I need some light in this bitch. I'm gonna do some fucking ballet, mate. Okay. Don't look at my outfit, okay? I'm chilling. Start here. I don't even fucking know. I can't do ballet. This is just me. me? Uh, dance moms. Ah, <sighs> oh, fuck me. <sighs> I didn't warm up. Okay, fuck that. <laughs> I know. I know. I know. I've been practicing ballet for like. 27 years now. Oh, fuck me. Yo, what up, guys? Welcome back to my YouTube channel. As you might know, we're gonna react to some fucking dance moms again. Because we fucking enjoy it. You know what I'm saying? So the last few times we've been reacted kind of blindly. We didn't even fucking know when it was aired, when it was filmed, because it looked like old shit. Some people helped me out. Now, thank you for that. Someone commented, Hey, my guy, dance mom stopped airing in like 2013. Or something, lol. Jojo is either 18 or 19 now. Just wanted to you to just want oh my god. Just wanted you to know there definitely are not five anymore, lol. Thanks for explaining. I appreciate that. But I knew they were not five. I was talking about the time it was a, it was filming, you know what I'm saying? Someone says it ended in 2013, but then someone else commented Dance Mom stopped airing in 2019. So when did it stop, huh? I think it was filmed until 2013, but they kept airing it until 2019. That's what I was thinking. Ew. We have Google. We're not gonna Google it because I'm lazy. Before we jump into it, don't forget to subscribe. Don't forget to like the video. Still waiting for you to subscribe. Big difference. Thank you very much and let's jump into it. It's gonna turn my camera a little bit if you're okay with that. Okay, I'm sorry for touching you. Hey, now I'm marking it. You forgot it? You're kidding me. Thank gosh we're running through it. Come on, Paige, you want to start with Leslie, one? were you a dance teacher in your past life? No, why? Because you tell her what to do. She's 14. I'm allowed to no, talk I to my daughter. No, I just think that you're treating her like a baby. I'm not treating her like a baby. I'm her mother and she's my daughter and she's... Wait, is, a is Abby... Is Abby... Oh, hold on a minute. Is Abby telling the mom she's treating her kid like a baby? Have rules reversed. Huh? Fuck it. Let's go. Let's go. I'm reiterating what you tell her all the time. If you don't yell it yet, you're never gonna know it. Got it? Not five minutes before you go on. <laughs> I get it. I get it. It's, it's the top. It's the top of the game. You should know. If it's just one post that she forgot just for that second, and it takes her a few seconds before she will know it again, she could know it. I'm just saying. <laughs> Moving on. We're on one number. Let's go. They have to know the number. Why don't you let them finish? Running it. If it goes on and we miss it, then it doesn't matter if they know it or not. What's the difference? Doesn't make a difference if they go on stage and it they look like make a difference. And look like the kids. Let them run Always. the number. If we don't get Leslie's there, it's your first week here. If they know it or not, what's the difference? We gotta go. You know what, Leslie? We've been doing this every single weekend. It will be fine. You're the new man on the block. I understand. But don't guess what? Wait. Are they gonna hold it for us? Probably not for Leslie Ackerman. Maybe for Abby Lee Miller. Okay. Okay. It's okay. my name, my reputation, not yours. <laughs> Hey, that's true though. I just love Abby's responses sometimes. She can be so fucking fierce. So truth and to the point. She's like, I don't fucking care whatever you think of me. I just fucking love it. That's what No, <laughs> exactly. you keep saying it's only you, but these kids are all the ones on the stage. I don't even want to know. Like, these kids already have huge pressure on them. Of all the, all the dances and being on the top. And all the parents' stress won't add any favor to that. <laughs> oh. Now be sitting there barking at these girls. It's my name. It's my name. And for God's sakes, we are so tired of hearing it's your name. It's not. When Chloe stands on stage, people are looking at Chloe. When Maddie's on stage, they're looking at Maddie and Nia. Yes, they dance under Abby's studio, but ultimately, they're the ones on stage. Yes, I get it. Fair point. I'm not gonna lie. They're still representing Abby's fucking dance club, whatever it is. I kind of get it. If they dance bad, Abby gets a bad name. And if it keeps going like that, eventually Abby gets no new kids. No new kids, no money. No money, no career. That's how it works, I think. I don't know, I'm not a teacher. I'm just a professional ballet dancer. Oh, fuck me. Stick with me too much, it didn't stand out much. The only thing that stood out in my mind was Peyton because she was eight feet taller than all the other kids. And I'm not 
sure she pulled off the bully role very well. What do you think your critique's gonna be? Look, look. Better than Kendall? I thought she did better than Kendall, too. Thanks. Oh man, how can you be in such a negative environment constantly? It's insane. I respect it though. I don't respect it, but respect to them for still standing. Jeez. Peyton, you almost screwed the whole entire dance up with the sign. You can't just like whoa, stick whoa, 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 whoa. No, no, whoa, whoa, me. You have no, to make sure it's on there. There's ponytails up high enough. Why are you gonna say Peyton did? Well, 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 yeah, but she has to correct what no, she's No, Abby, up. it starts from the beginning and did it should. Did you say no, Abby? No, Abby. I thought she did fabulous. Right, and you're not a dance teacher. Hey, you tell me how you thought she did. I thought she was okay. I think your turns, suit new, never crossed your thighs once. You need to fix that turnout. <laughs> Parents always think they're in their fucking right to tell what they did good and wrong instead of the teacher. And they go in discussion as well. Of course, you can say if you think she did it right, but if Abby, the teacher, you did something fucking wrong, it's just critique on it so that you can learn, you take that. Okay. I thought that I was better than most of the people. For you all thought you were better than most of the people in this group? Wise. Oh, that's cocky. But that's how I feel, performance wise. Oh. Mm. I was appalled. I cannot believe that a 14 year old young adult. Look at that face. <laughs> she wants to snap someone's neck, and I know who's. Damn. I don't know why, I always love her face expressions. <laughs> it's such a Karen. <laughs> she didn't even say anything. Just her face expressions is already a Karen. We have a really nice camaraderie amongst the girls here, but we don't critique each other. I ask you how you felt about you, not in comparison to everyone else, just about your performance. So everybody was perfect but Peyton? No. You didn't critique one other person? I don't need to. Peyton did for me. <laughs> Oh, that was an evil laugh. Deep from the heart. <laughs> Damn. That overinflated ego, huh? This group's been winning, 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 winning. Do you think they lost because of her? I don't know. I don't know. I'll have to read the judges' comments and listen to the critiques and see what they say. Well, is she going to be able to dance with the team again? I don't know. I don't think what she did on stage really is what my concern is. It was coming back to the dressing room and saying that she was fabulous no, and everybody you, else You stuck. know what? You flustered her. She didn't mean it like that. You're, you're talking to a 14-year-old. If you want to fight with I know. somebody, then you I fight mean, with me, her mother. I, it's not I about fighting, her. Leslie. If you can't say anything nice, don't say anything at all. <laughs> Isn't that what Abby always does? <laughs> Saying just everything she thinks. She doesn't fucking care. <sighs> I love this show. I just love these compilations. Abby's really mad at Peyton. Why? Because of the way it came out when Peyton was talking about the rest of the group dance right. and her performance in comparison to everyone else. I, I will speak for myself. I took it the same way that Abby said it. Wait, wait. And then she apologized and then you're still saying this to me? Um, you didn't let me finish my comment. Well, because I'm pissed off, that's why. Thanks. You don't accept apologies from a 14-year-old? I did accept and your apology. Don't have conversation with me. But Wait, no, 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 there's no, 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 I don't know why I, st <laughs> I still have to laugh at her face. For the first time, she is not the one yelling. And I'm still laughing because of her. <sighs> I'm still upset, Abby. I know, but Leslie, you know what? Your daughter's 14 years old. You say that she's a grown-up, she's this, she's that. She has a smart mouth on her. You need to dig your fingernails into her mouth and tell her to wait, shut her mouth. Okay, stop. Did you not put her on the spot that got her to to that point where she said something wrong and apologized to you. You did not put her on this team because of her comment. The fact that the children accept every solution. This happened, I said this, whatever, they accept it. The moms keep going. They can't just shut the fuck up. It's not even about them. It's your kid, I get it. Kinda, I don't have kids, so I... You get the point, okay? But these moms just keep going. Let it rest, kids are tired. So much stress on them already. Just shut the fuck up. Next, Mackenzie. Mackenzie, when I took you out of the group, I gave you this cute little part to do. And thank goodness, it was humorous. Because had they started timing our number, we would have been disqualified. And the Abby Lee Dance Company is not gonna get disqualified. All she had to do was grab this rope and pull the carpet across the stage. She kept getting it stuck. I will never forgive Mackenzie for what she did. She made a mockery of the beginning of that routine. <laughs> Oh my god. 
It's like someone fucking killed your family or <laughs> robbed your house. I will never forget that again. <laughs> Oh, Abby. I get it. She made a mistake, but it's so fucking exaggerated. Ex exec, exec, ex English. I think there's enough pressure on Maddie without being compared to Sophia. But now I know how the mo other moms feel when Abby does it. What the fuck is going on with this hair? I don't know. What creeps me out a little bit? <laughs> Look at this dude. I don't get it. What happened over the weekend? Friday, I was here. Right. So you didn't come to rehearsal Sunday. You're 14. You've been taking ballet class right. since you were six or seven years old. Gabby, if she's gonna do that, like she spent the entire week learning the number with this group, why wouldn't she just go away with us and compete the number? But that doesn't mean you don't do anything dance-wise all weekend. Makes sense, right? I mean, if you have rehearsals in a weekend, you gotta go to rehearsals, especially when you're on the top. <sighs> Abby, I'm with you this time. <laughs> I want a team, and each and every member of the team has- It amazes me. No, it doesn't amaze me. <laughs> Who am I lying? Every clip, every fucking clip, everyone has different hairstyles. I mean, the Karens are still the Karens, don't get me wrong. But they suddenly have a different hairstyle. Different colors, different hairstyle, different looks. How? Is that normal? I like it. It spices things up a bit, and they probably get paid enough so they can. But, the fuck? Brady, you are clearly the best- Don't get me wrong, but didn't know there were guys in here as well answer on this team but i'm not going to put all my eggs in one basket i've made that mistake before so regardless of the talent brady is going on a break what yep it might be a little break or it might be a really long break i mean what does that mean he's going on a break he's going home and each and every one of you girls are going to learn what it's like to carry the routine yourselves. I am. <laughs> Imagine, yeah? You're the only fucking guy in the whole dance group and you're killing it so hard, carrying so hard that you get a break. Get the fuck home. You're great. <laughs> I mean, I would walk there like a motherfucking boss. I just want to say that I worked very hard to get here where I am today. And now I'm going to be miserable. Life's not fair. <laughs> oh, so dramatic. <laughs> It's a show, it's a show, I get it, but so much drama. It's not fair. Abby's, you know, kind of been acting crazy. And then on the other side, Holly is pissed off. It's gonna be a rough day, I can tell. I don't owe you an, 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 an explanation. You do. If I wasn't there, just guess it was a darn good reason. And if it's and, a darn good reason, and, and why could you share Gianna it? Gianna was there. If I'm not there, I'll send somebody. Abby is not doing her job. What she did last week was wrong. Kind of get it. She just wants the revenge, right? Like, <laughs> after all those fucking years. You need to be there. Otherwise, you get off the fucking pyramid. She gets back at her. I get it. So, if I don't need her and she doesn't need me, what the hell is she still doing here? Well, because she's a part of this team. But she doesn't need to be. Everyone's replaceable. I believe she wants to be. <laughs> uh, <clears throat> Apparently. <laughs> Jojo, you're on the bottom because you're not even on the team. We'll just move you over here. You're not part of it. Okay, let's get it. Get it. We're getting it. <laughs> Abby is not amused. Okay, let's go. Nia, that's you next. I'm sure she would have fought with me about that. We have you next. You're good. No one dares to say a thing. You can feel the tension from here. This is filmed 10 years ago. You still feel the tension. She. Mackenzie, same thing. And then we have Kalani, not a lot to judge you on. And then on the top again, we have Maddie. Great, congratulations. There you go. Sheer talent. I'm sure we'll be embarrassed and humiliated there. Yo, is she all right? Does she need a drink or something? <laughs> She's going for it. Oh. I just pretend it doesn't matter. I can't pretend anymore. Nobody is gonna talk to me that way. No one! Abby upset and crying? Man, he must have hit the nerve. That's a first timer. I'm not gonna stand here and do something that I don't wanna do. I don't wanna do it. I wanna teach dance. I wanna be creative. 
I want to do this. And more. Once again, Abby's leaving us. And this time, I really don't know if she's coming back. Damn. That was a suspense ending. Man, we hit the roller coaster this episode. We went left, right, top, center, whatever. <laughs> But I enjoyed it though. In the end, I don't know, Abby was crying or walking away. I've never seen that before. Hey, new things. I feel bad for her. I don't enjoy seeing people cry. Don't get me wrong. But it's mad entertainment though. Yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this episode as well as the others. Go hit that like button. Don't forget to subscribe to my fucking YouTube channel. Okay. Thank you very much. I love you. And I'll see you in the...